Hi there. So in this video, we are going to take a look at URL parameters in Node Express project. So some of the times when we make Express project, we have to send some dynamic ID to URL and render the output accordingly. Let's say, for example, if I take your name through form and I want to show your name in, let's say, some form output, then I can make use of URL parameter. Okay, so we're going to take a look at simple example through which you can understand how to take that through route and then output on page. Okay, so first thing, open text editor and create one page sample.js. Okay, save the file and now let's create one constant express then call for express package next thing another constant variable name it app and initialize your express class then we will call for app.get then for route i'm going to simply create request response and then call for resource.send and here i'm going to call Dynami URL parameter example. You can also embed some form on this page and make your route to check that page so that you can get this example better. But for simplicity, let's go with this flow. Next thing, app.get and let's create another route. Name it P and then colon ID. Okay, now I'm going to create one function that handles this ID parameter. So request response and then inside this function I'm going to use resource.send and then I'm going to use ID is and then we will simply use plus sign outside these quotes and then use require dot parameters params dot id okay that's it outside this function we are going to use app dot listen then 3000 okay next thing open terminal clear screen and then use node name of your file hit enter it should start the server now open your browser and go for localhost 3000 and here you have your typical route message now i'm gonna call for my route where I'm going to pass some number let's say 5000 is that number and that will be treated as ID parameter and it will be rendered on page and as you can see it shows ID is 5000 which is exactly what we wanted to show as per this route send request okay so you get the idea how you can use this in forms or some session information or any other use that you can find for url parameter so this was short demo on how to work with your parameters in node express project